Time to begin our amazing adventure. Or, well, okay, I don't think I can have this long of a name. The game gives me a couple tools and an entire car for free. Then it's time to cut down our first tree. Alrighty, I guess we're cutting down this tree. Uh, wait, did you guys see that? Obviously, the game wants me to cut down the smaller tree, and who am I to deny the game what it wants? I mean, of course, it's the game. It knows exactly what it's talking about. I promptly sell the entire tree, mine some ore, and make Tony Hawk look like a little bitch. To putting on a few pounds, I found the best shop in the entire game. Of course, I'm talking about the one and only Eric shop that I can't fit in. Luckily for me, I was able to meet the man himself. I attempted to do a little dance for him, but due to my sheer fucking weight, my legs crushed under the pressure of my body when standing on one foot. I attempted to leave, but then flipped my car over like the fat ass I am. Oh, get on! I'm stuck. I decided to go on my first ore run, but I can only take half as many ores as normal people, cause my ass takes up half of my f***ing capacity. Yeah, my screen shakes when I walk, what about it? I know you guys can't see it over my hentai hoodie, but I am in fact holding a pickaxe. I had a heart attack and God attempted to lift me into heaven, but his attempts were futile as I just fell right back down. Pretty sure these things are supposed to make you float in the air, but you know, lifting me is one massive start, I have to say. Alright, we're all loaded up and ready to go god damn it guys i know it would seem impossible but someone actually lifted me up and kidnapped me i can't believe this won't you give your great grandfather a hug come on baby i know you want some because god damn i'm throwing it back also, I found out you can build in this game, so with this knowledge, give me one second to make a masterpiece. Well, let me have a rule and a saw and a board and I'll cut it. I'll climb up a ladder with a hammer and a nail and I'll nail it. Well, we worked so hard to build a little house together. In the snow or the rain or the ice cold wind, whenever, no matter what the weather, we're together. First, the only worker that we could find puts the wood on top of the wood cutter. Next, the top of the line machinery turns the wood into planks. We make sure to use the top of the line machinery because the other machinery is on smoke break. As any good lumber company, we make sure our wood reaches for the stars. We pride ourselves at making sure your wood has a good time. We even allow the wood to participate in a dropper. Any wood that lands on the left side gets escorted off the premises, while any wood that lands on the right side gets to continue on. The wood would then get traveled through a machine that was half-assedly built to check for contraband. If it's able to get past all the lag, the wood would then travel up this giant spiral to show off all my many, many cars. I just like to flex on the wood as much as possible. The wood would then land on a lazy Susan, where it would either spend the rest of its life singing, You spin me right around, baby, or it will fall off. The wood could either land on the left side, where it will continue on its normal path, or it can land on the right side, where it will be punished accordingly. Then the wood participates in recreating 9-11. Now that they're banned on all forms of social media, the wood is finally forced to watch all of my videos. Honestly, who even cares about the wood? Let's just expand my car collection. And while I do this, listen to some of DJ Axis's music.
So, as you can tell, I have just a few cars. I just really want to make sure my collection's nice and broad. I just have everything. Probably a lot of rare stuff inside of here. Who knows? And oh my god, there goes my frame rate. Oh my god, I fell in! Oh my god, I fell in! Let me out! Let me out! I don't want to die! I don't want to die here! Oh my god! This is a public server too, and there's like only one guy who was able to withstand what I did. I'm gonna see if I can find this mysterious hot dog man. Oh, okay, I guess this is just gonna be the gameplay from now on. Get ready for a lot of those. So this over here is world spawn before you teleport to your base. Basically all these people are waiting for their games to load so they can actually play. Not knowing that their game will never load because of what I did. I pretty much just locked the game. Hey, you wanna hop in my car? I'm sure you, I'm not gonna bring you somewhere where your phone will overheat and burn your hands. Even this guy surprised by what I did. New server time, boys. Time to crash another, so oh god, no. I forgot my spawn was in here. No, wait, I don't wanna die. I don't wanna die, let me out. Stop, don't load the cars, just let me out. I don't wanna die. I don't wanna be trapped under all this. Get me the f*** out of here. Oh my god. Oh no. No, 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 no. Let me out. 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 Please, I don't want to die. This is karma. Karma's coming back for me. Just let me go. Okay. Oh my god. Ah, time to join this nice, lovely, peaceful game. Ah! Alrighty. Which save slot do I want to play on? I can barely move without getting hit by a pause, and I'm sure everyone else in the server is getting the same treatment. And since I'm using an Xbox, one of the newer versions, it's able to withstand this just a little bit, but their phones are not able to. I am destroying servers as fast as I'm joining them, which isn't very fast, actually. But hey, if you like this video, be sure to join us next time, where I'll be forcefully delivering drugs to people's houses. I will give no context to that.